A groundbreaking new study from UC Davis. Researchers there have found that taking prenatal vitamins during the first month of pregnancy actually might lower the chances of having a second child with autism. CBS 13's Yasmin Hassan has more. And that was one of my biggest concerns with my oldest son being autistic was, okay, is his brother going to be autistic too? What can I do to try and help? Researchers say if you have one child with autism, your next child is about 13 times more likely to develop the disorder. But this new study is giving those families hope. I don't want him to go through the same stuff my oldest has to go through. The study found that taking prenatal vitamins in the first month of pregnancy can reduce the risk of autism reoccurrence in high-risk families. The moms that reported um, taking a prenatal vitamin were about half as likely to have another child, this younger sibling, with autism. Researchers think the folic acid may be a big contributing factor here. It is linked to healthy brain development throughout childhood. If you want to do anything that's going to help your babies, so, I mean, I would do anything to help her. So I took prenatals my whole pregnancy. This doesn't just affect families who have a child with autism. Children whose mothers took vitamins early in their pregnancy also showed higher cognitive scores. You know, it's just wanting to, you know, to keep, you know, your child safe, you know, whether it's autism, you know, different types of, you know, diseases, you know, whatever it is. But yeah, it's always in the back of your mind. It helps a lot um, just knowing that something so small can make a huge difference. Researchers say if you are trying to get pregnant, make sure you talk to your doctor about taking the vitamins right away.